later on our YouTube, Indian Lear, along with... Drakir. And that was extra loud. And, 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 <laughs> and yeah, welcome back everyone who may be watching to Blood Omen 2 for the fourth time. And yeah, it's, it's becoming more and more obvious why this game isn't liked. And come on, let me... Wait, already the fourth time? Yeah, this is the fourth episode. Now, let's see, I was told a trick to keep a better check on if there are people uh, watching or not. And that's by watching my own channel <laughs> on my phone. Uh, <laughs> so let's give that a shot to see if, how that goes. And you'll have to silence this thing, of course. And then I should be able to check. I fail to see how I should see people watching with this now, or how many people are in the chat. Oh, there, chat only. Apply. And there we go. Okay, hopefully that'll update live, and that'll, gi that'll give me a view if <laughs> there are actually people watching this or not. Ah, alright, and that's my Oh, hello, uh, You're eager to die. Damn. Ow. I, sh I should really see those coming now every time they duck down like that. Yeah. They are really. <laughs> Broke off there a little bit too much. Oh, which is good because those attacks can really do a number on us. True. And then again, if you want a very realistic combat, you would be very hard to play. To an orderly society. My father says, "Oh, you and your father. Don't you see? The order and discipline the Seraphim impose on the lower orders are for everyone's good. They respect us. They know their place." My father says there was a time when the great noble families ruled the land, with a king over all. It's just the same now, the Seraphim Lord. But we, the nobles of the land, are not being permitted to have a proper influence upon affairs. Speak for yourself. We cringe and we pay. Many an ancient family has been brought to ruin by the unending taxes. And where is the money going? He's not even building palaces. Does your father say that too? My father has disappeared. Oh, I am so sorry. Summoned to a meeting. Don't tell me anything more. Never returned. So I've been thinking that if we, the young nobles, could meet. I've just remembered I have a very important uh, something I must do at once. Yeah, he fully <laughs> knows what's going on. People who talk bad tend to get off. Now, what is this here? Okay, yeah. it's one of those uh, fuse things, but it, it's held in a box for some reason. You know, like a hint to me, it would be just weirder. Yeah. So, what is this thing? Oh, I might go away from that. Okay, that lowered one, but brought the other up. So yep. do I... Okay, that... Oh, they're coming to investigate now. Uh-oh. Oh, no. So many light bulbs. Might be better if I keep that turned off. What is... Okay, uh, I get the... F yeah, I get the feeling I need to bring that thing over here. Because the other fuse on the is broken. Hmm. I guess the is on them just to make sure no one uh, knows what you do now. 
Yeah, but it is pretty easy to get them out by just climbing a ladder and throwing a switch. Yeah, they definitely could have done it a bit better. Yeah, but 200 years of uh, ruling play a place typically makes people complacent. Yeah. Like, if they actually wanted these things to not be messed with, they'd put the entire gate on the lock and key here. Yeah. Unless the uh, gate is for something else? Okay, what does this activate? No, oh, just a door. Like, I know it's... I know it's fancy and all, but do you really need magic to open freaking doors? But I hope people have electrical uh, doors to open, but those are more for uh, if you sit in a car and such. Okay, can I try and get the drop on one of these? Uh, no, they act. They actively sense where we are. Yeah, there must be something about that armor that allows us to do that. Yeah, seeing as they light up like a freaking Christmas tree whenever I get near. <laughs> yep, like throw a sword. Yep. Except it doesn't look cool. Okay, we were headed for the bishop last time, but we've been getting sidetracked by these assholes. We were told to be on the lookout for a vampire. You ought to kill him on sight. Okay, draw sword stabs the asshole. <laughs> <laughs> if you're only that stupid. You there. You for the bishop, don't you? I've three crates of wine to deliver. I don't work for him. Oh yes, you do. I've seen you there. That is implied just this minute. I wouldn't go near the place if I were you. Why not? I've got this wine. Seraphim searching the house. Thanks, friend. I owe you for that. Well, he now has three crates of free wine. Huh? Yeah, he, he said he was delivering wine, but uh, yeah, if the cops are raiding the place, then uh, you don't want to be near. Okay, I should be able to sneak up on these idiots. Hopefully. I prefer the one JK does it with the skull. It makes more sense. Yeah. We have it also. <laughs> oh, come on, are you going? <laughs> are you going to <laughs> kick you? <laughs> what? A... <laughs> and and Kane is supposed to be the asshole. They're literally kicking a man when he's down and dying. <laughs> well, he's already dead. Uh. All right. I would like a good realistic sound to them dying on onto the ground with the armor. Come on, cut this guy's skull in two, will you, Kane? Oh, come on! Like, do we have to be a certain distance away or something for the different animations to trigger? Uh, I would not be surprised if it's uh, random. <clears throat> Pardon? Also, we got something special today. Oh, that is? Uh, something I wish I could share with you. Sneakers. <laughs> I don't I think, think I've actually... Why. <laughs> uh, well, Kane isn't hungry, but he is thirsty. You? But, uh, again... Between you and him, you probably will not need the sneakers more. Okay, let's see... Is this locked off as well? Nope. Also, um, I I think it was you that notified me and hello. Yeah. 
Hmm? But about the, the new Art World game that's out. Yep. Yeah, it, it's on the Epic Game Store for now at least only and, because of and those stupid. Hmm? And PlayStation. Okay. Uh, I have. N oh, come on! Uh, an invisible wall in the middle of the air. What? Yeah, I have no intention of buying anything on the Epic Games Store because their exclusivity uh, bullshit is basically starting the console wars, but on the PC, which nobody wants. Like, if yeah. they if they sold the games, there's of course the point that they give the developers a better price. But they could do that and just let everyone else sell the game as well. Let people come yeah. to your store because you offer a better deal than the other stores. If you're just going to steal deals away from people, then you're not doing it for the people, then you're doing it because you're a crazy asshole. Yeah. I know the company that makes the uh, old world. They only accepted the thing because they needed the money to finish the game. Yeah. And so again, they, again they could have found they could have funded them and just let them release every on all the other platforms. So yeah, nice that they gave the funding, but still for their own gain and not for the developers or the gamers' sake. I just glad that there is on the uh, PlayStation as well. Otherwise, it would be way worse. And oh, I think yeah. it's one of the few games that many actually in PlayStation Five just to play Old World, but they do not want to uh, play on the Epic Game Store. Okay, where the hell are we supposed to go? If we're supposed to go up there, where if we're being blocked from just jumping in here? But so... I also hope. Uh, that one will come to Steam within a year or something like that. Yeah, that, that's typically the case that they ha it's on Epic Store for a year exclusively and then it releases to Steam and elsewhere. Yeah. So, yeah, next year perhaps we might be streaming, uh, yes, Oddworld Soul, St Soul Storm. Yep, yeah, true sequel oh. to the first game. I heard that uh, the Soul Storm is to put the full sequel to the first game due to this one is supposed to be what they wanted the, the second game to be in at last. Okay, because there was, uh, let's see, uh, Apes Odyssey, then, no, Oddworld. I think there were three ga Oddworld games with Apes' name in them. Then there was Stranger's Wrath, Munch's something I forget what exactly uh, yeah there was of course Oddworld the new and tasty the remake uh, hello boys uh, okay yeah new, new and tasty the remake if you change the new long it can uh, isn't it just uh, the first Oddworld but basically made in better graphics and such, to my knowledge it was. I mean it is, uh, no, I, know about the, I know the first game is the canon, but the second game is no longer canon. For this, uh, it replaced with Soulstorm for uh, being, as I said before, the original story they wanted to tell it. Okay. Just that you can do much of the things due to uh, something. Yes, uh, technical Yeah, technical limitation. Yeah, and probably, even though they expect the story a lot, they couldn't probably not even do most of the story due to difficult, again, technical difficulties or something else preventing them from telling the story. I think I remember now, it was Abe's Exodus that was the second game, I think. Yep. Yeah. And the Soulstorm Brew was a big part of that. Uh, of, of that game. Oh yeah, they are actually quite darker. Yeah, it, it's pretty dark when you're having people dig up the bones of their ancestors to have those bones made into, well, a soda, basically. Actually, uh, do you mind if I give you a little spoiler? Of Exodus or the Soulstorm? 
just all of the brew what I've done in the new game. Okay. It, only, only, we only give you this spoiler, because there's a lot of things I mean not to tell about the game. They made the brew a bit darker. Darker than necro, you know, <laughs> rave robbing. It's still grave robbing. However, they made something work. It, it had a more dangerous spice to it. They feed it to the Modokians workers freely. Problem is, if they stop drinking it after a while, if they escape, they can die. Okay, that, it's, that's actually not too different from the original. Because in the original, it would eventually drive them insane, I think. Yeah, here, yeah, especially, especially at one Yeah. However, what I'm talking about is what I've been saying. Here, you will get withdrawal syndrome and then actually just die. Okay, so the Gluckens basically ba being assholes as always. Yep. So and how, tall do these, how tall do these people think they are when a <laughs> cane like a six foot at least uh, vampire is only half as tall as the fucking doors here? Huh, it looks lower to me. You never been to Sweden? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, just kidding folks. We are not that tall. Even if pe people wish we were that tall. Let's see, is this... Okay, someone has been here already. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. they, they did say that the Seraphim are sacking the place. Yep, but yeah, I'm not gonna spoil too much of the, that the Soulstorm, or I wanna leave much to him to see back here later in the year. Oh! What? Oh, the... yeah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, hello, big boy! Yeah, have a no, he's just as bald as all the other idiots. Yeah, but he, his face is still scrummed up like a baby. Very grumpy baby. <laughs> oh god. He has a one headed bargage? <laughs> Nope, that tired him out, and... Okay, so much for the Seraph and Shredder. Gimme. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, a fucking Buster Sword. Well, it, it's, some, it's some kind of axe, and... But I, I heard that there is an axe that looks like this. Normally, is you don't swing it. Basically, if someone were to try... You there. Oh. What's your business here? Who are you? I beg you, be merciful, good sir. I am... I was butler to the Bishop of Meridian, but the, the, the Seraphim, they're, they're inside now. I, I, I thought I would wait here. Where are they? They accuse the Bishop of aiding the vampire resistance. They're looking for proof. I beg of you, do not tell them where to find me. I will do anything. Yes, you will. Tell me where to find the Bishop. I... I can't. I, I, I mean, I don't know. Shall I ease your mind and tell you I am sent by Vorador for the Vampire Resistance? Or shall I simply tear out your throat and continue my search? I leave the decision to you. The Cathedral. He fled there. He thought he would be safe. Holy ground will not deter his pursuer. Where is the Cathedral? To the northeast. But it will do me no good. You cannot enter without the proper authority. I suggest you show me the way. Now! Of course, sir. This way, sir. It is my pleasure to serve you. This tunnel will bring you again to the streets. I thank you. Good night. Okay, I think he actually means to kill him there, but... Uh, yeah, let's be a bit less of an asshole than Cain. <laughs> Yeah! Hello, statue! Is, isn't that the one we saw before? Possibly, but it looked a bit more... only inviting! Okay, might have been because of the... yeah, the different light. Also, in chat... 
eat Erzul rules? Can you do ASMR, please? <laughs> Uh, I'm not sure if my voice would actually be good for that because personally I think my voice typically sounds boring uh, and dull, but I guess some people like that in ASMR. I'm still trying to answer what ASMR is. Um, if I remember correctly, it, it sounds that cause a calming reaction in the brain or something. And hello there, lighthouse. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, I would. Somehow that blow didn't connect with me, even though he clearly stabbed me in the guts. Yeah. Oh, that's what I was saying earlier. There are guards that are just like that in the line. But they're not used for combat. Okay. You have, you have the two guards by door. And if someone puts a chest box, they drop the axe on them. So basically, a portable guillotine. Basically, yeah, because it's too heavy to move this thing around. So you just let the gravity do the work. Also, another thing that it sort of looks like uh, is one of those. I, f I forget the name, but those Klingon blades. Yeah, it, actually, I agree. We also had a thing I thought uh, that it looked like a Baklek or something. Uh, uh, Baklek or something. It's, yeah. it's been ages since I've played a Star Trek game, so yeah, I've completely forgotten the name. And we have one of those mind control priests here again. Yeah, I, I don't know that many people struggle to agree on how you supposed to pronounce it. But it's something like Bathlet. Bathlet. That's yeah. me. I think the spelling is B A T, then an apostrophe. L E T H, if my memory is correct, which it's 50 50 percent chance, I'd say. <laughs> yeah, it, it, it has history in weapon concept, even though, depending on the sign, many of them uh, are yeah, actually quite useless to use. Yeah. But there are some people that have come up with some good ideas, how you could design it to be somewhat effective. And this one um, is an interesting design. Yeah, it's ba it's basically an oversized X hat. Yeah, yeah it makes me think they are this. But yeah, just bigger and you're shot off lower half of it. And I just realized something. Uh, let's see if we can lure one of these away to... Yeah, thank you for volunteering. Now just wait for him to get back up and he should be weak enough. I was thinking he tried to bisect the motherfucker, instead just bonk, bonk, bonk. Uh, get back here, you motherfucker. Bonk, 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 bonk. Well, it, it is, it is to, it does to make the most sense to do that, instead of just wasting your energy trying to swing that thing around. True, but... Is it quite heavy to try to do that due to the all the weight being behind you? Look, <laughs> <laughs> uh, look, it's disturbing. As often you drop them, they're still wiggling a bit, like uh, 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 coughing or something. Uh, okay, okay, that that shows that even uh, <clears throat> even games that don't live up to expectation can still be a lot of fun. <laughs> Just by finding it, the stupidities inside of them. Yeah, especially when you have a lunatic like me go commentating with you. Hey, I thought I was supposed to be the lunatic. We both can be lunatics. <laughs> and also, I think I, I really just realized something about ASMR. And that is? 
I think the person who asked about it noticed me unwrapping maybe candy near the mine. Uh, yep. <laughs> that, yeah, that might certainly be an ASMR sound. <laughs> it took me a while to realize it. I have to say this this thing has a lot of durability and that sadly seems to be the what the thing that uh, is most of the most different between weapons. Okay. <laughs> okay, that was more what I was thinking about. Uh, yeah, the main difference between weapons seems to be how durable they are. Oh yeah. Uh, I Decapitation! Uh, okay, that, that was my w worst attempt of Jack Black. So my yeah. only attempt at Jack Black. Uh, I could give it a shot, but uh, there's people downstairs uh, at the moment, <laughs> so they'd likely get go, what the fuck is going on up there? Same, I, I'll try to have the whole back of it. Uh, I thought so did. Oh, I thought it was a door. Wait, the, well, the panels. Okay. So, very big buttons. That looks like the re. Uh, I forget the name actually for a moment from Warframe, the uh, the oh. shadow assassin that chases after you. The Ankh here. There's another Ankh. No, it, it, it's not a puzzle, we just need to push all of of these, it, I think. Wait, I recognize that. Look at that one of the vampire symbols. Oh, wait. No, it's not vampire. Uh, no, I'm. I don't recognize this uh, from Soul Reaver One. It's not one of Raziel's uh, gangs. Yeah. Uh, I think that's children. Could be. Yeah, back for more again. And there it was toggled again. I I just do not get why it keeps switching between toggle and and the hold with the auto facing system. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, come the fuck on. I don't know if that's a bug that is from the old game on the new PC, or if all the been there. And the biggest issue we have now, our big ass sword is gone. Uh -oh. Okay, yeah, that's a problem. For that thing wrecked everything. Come on, you, you glowy motherfucker. I, I like how Kane uses his, his van braces to block here when he's unarmed. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, come over here, you idiot. Just let him tire himself out. And yep. I I do not like the invincibility frames they have during that whilst they're getting up. Come here. Fuck off. <laughs> I must I must say any game where you can just Pick up someone and bitch slap them away. That, that will always get an extra point in my book. <laughs> they, they have many good combat things here, but the the thing that's almost uh, I think you can agree with me. The thing that is kind of ruining the combat here is the whole uh, auto aim uh, thing going on. Yeah, it's it's because it supports. There's always issues when paint game. Well, there's typically issues when games are ported. Alright, so you expect that if you had played this on a PlayStation, it would work smoother? Maybe. 
Yeah, I hope so. For if he did not get put through for the decision and had the same problem, that would be serious. Okay, uh, already drained that guy. Take this one, sword. And here we go again. Hello. Yep. You're quick on the draw for a priest. <laughs> Are you the uh, I kick R's for the Lord kind? And uh, he's right. Yeah. Oh, almost forgot. Over here. That was an uh, old owl. Right, let's over this way. Yeah, I still like the, the motor combat here again, except for that uh, other thing going on and the aesthetic of the game. Oh, hello. The door not... closed. But that's just damn wonderful. But, uh, uh, but yeah, I will not just judge the story yet. I feel like it's too early for me to judge her story. It does feel a lot slower because basically what we've Ooh. had so far is uh, Kane got his ass kicked, has been sleeping for 200 years, now he has a new guy in town. And uh, yeah, we fought one flunky. Uh, yeah, it, it feels a bit like a, a less uh, is happening or ha. Yeah. No, I don't care. Sometimes I think I'm sort of a bit slow before I get to Yeah. Uh, and I I could just be being picky because uh, <laughs> because uh, the Soul Reaver games were just playing better in comparison. Four. <laughs> yeah. You know, I could see some element of this could run the other games better. And yeah, most of most of the combat. Just for that. He's getting the nutcracker treatments. <laughs> <laughs> At least he didn't stab him with the pointy end of his coin. Now that is just really horrifying to see that thing. Yeah, Kane would probably be thinking of doing like that, but he doesn't have the time for it. Because, yeah, Kane is a bastard no matter what. <laughs> Dead, living, undead. Ah, finally. Yeah. Though the game has been running a lot better since we've switched it to only one processor. Hello. No, I hope you don't mind me helping you remind you of some things. Oh, hello. Here, the, here's the guy, the bishop. Greetings, old man. I assume that I address the Bishop of Meridian. I seek information on gaining access to the Sarafan Keep. You are to give me passage inside. I am sent by Vorador. What ails you? Speak! He speaks only at my command. What? You are too late, Kay. He is entirely in my power. Release him and I may spare your life. I hold the cards now, Cain. Surrender yourself to me, or I will kill him. What do I care for the life of some mortal? But the thought of killing you at last entices me. Tell me, Marcus, do you truly believe you can stop me? Stay back. You cannot win. The bishop will tell you nothing while he remains under my power, and you will never catch me. And apparently he just killed the bishop anyway. Wait, I, I, I saw that he had his tongue cut out, so... <laughs> this will be a sleeping. Wait, weren't we here before? We were here before! Motherfucker ran in a circle.
Yeah. Okay, get back here, you bald bastards. I've seen the MVP of this, but, you know, this was the boss fight I watched. Uh, this was before I decided to stop. I don't support myself too hard. Okay. Now he's just being a prick who's delaying me the inevitable. Yeah. Let's see, are I you waiting I... up? Are you waiting for me up here? I feel like they should do better sound work on the house and cats. There you are. Of course. I'm not paying for that. <laughs> the camera took a moment to catch up there. <laughs> Bad idea. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and. Oh, hello, boss fights. Okay, where are you, you slippery motherfucker? I saw him here for a moment. Hmm. What is the deal here? He's hiding in the shadows. Oh, there you are. Okay, he's so he we basically battle him the same as uh, Jarrell. We use sound to stun him, and then we kick his ass. In the meanwhile, though, I should switch to this. Ah, like this. Oh, oh, come on, you cheap fuck! <laughs> and now we lose our weapon. Yeah, yeah, you can snicker all you want. Here, have a fish, Snickers. You had to see that when I was just ate the last one. And <laughs> yeah, I had more, but I didn't see those for the weekend. Oh, by the way, those chocolate um, discs, I think, would be the best uh, description. The, Dan the Scandinavian ones, the, <clears throat> the uh, chocolate stall, or the candy stall had those again uh, yesterday. So yeah, I, I stocked up again. Yeah, they are good, however, that's yeah. not the normal uh, product they sell. Okay. That's the more fancier one version, like... The thing that sold the most of is entire chocolate bars, like, you know, big blocks of chocolate. Okay. Not like just but like a big, big one you break up in tiny squares. Yeah, I, I personally like, prefer to just bite off chunks of a, and not, not of those small bits, but just uh, take a bite and tear off a piece, like it's a slab of meat or something. Yeah, you can do that. Depending on what flavor, there are many flavors that do, like uh, candy cane for some reason, Oreo. They have reason. Here's the thing: if you try the uh, Marabo Oreo flavor, you do with your own risk. Yeah, we got a double hit on him there. <laughs> nice. Here's the thing: it is good, folks. It's good. Human is a bit too good. It's kind of like you have to have more. Yeah, we. It sounds a bit like milk. Uh, we that Oh, hello. Because that has a, that, a billion alternate versions as well. Oh. It might be something similar. He calls in uh, healing bags for reinforcements, or to destroy those. Oh! That was a bit unnecessary. 
Wait, did they just... They hanged themselves. What? But wait. He might control them if he didn't see the beam. Yeah, you can see by the sparkles on them. And give me that weapon. I thought the sparkle was their own thing. Like the monk. Uh, no, it's not. Give, give me your blood. And give me that. Where, where is it? Okay, his weapon is just plain gone. You didn't, you didn't say please. Uh, Kane says please with his boots. Oh, okay. So he just plain jokes them like that. Oh, hello. You're still al you're still alive. Yes. Not right. for long. Who are you? And he, he has to move back. Oh, we, we already got him. Great. His weapon disappeared as well. Did some. Oh, hello there. Oh, I think I get what we're supposed to do now. But first, let's uh, deal with this little prick. Get to throw the monk at the bells? Yep. <laughs> Ooh. Is it for Cosimodo? Oh, wait. No, I hope I expect that to be one in this game. Now, I think we already killed him. He was covered in all the metal and such. You mean the one with the giant axe? Yeah. Can we make face another one so we can steal his axe? Please? <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh... Okay, he ran up on us there. <laughs> but we fell down. So, yeah. We know what to do. Oh, thank you. Look, 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 look. Let me up this pest. Okay, sounds like he summoned new <clears throat> bowling balls for us to work with. Come on. We have to be in a more specific spot, and there he goes. Okay, why doesn't that allow me to jump over that? Wait, it's a Oh, wait, that dropped though. Uh, yeah. Okay, why is he. Not bothering with his invisibility anymore. Uh, good question. Why don't we ask him uh, off close and personal? Yeah, once we get him to sit still long enough. Okay, so we don't re actually have to weaken them, we just have to <laughs> find a moment to grab them. Okay, there he is. That, yeah, he's probably already gone. Yep, he's running away. Oh, we we can still get him some hits while he's being a jackass. So, uh, what happened to all your speed? You think you can catch me? Okay, now he went invisible again, or not? If he 
it's a weird sensitive. Would that affect his speed, actually? That the balance organs for uh, movement is in the ear, so if I remember right. Uh, yeah, it could be that the music hasn't, not, not the music, the sound hasn't dazed. Yeah, so he's, yeah, he's unable to rock basically, due to, yeah, that organ is in the uh, high something, I forget the English words here. Uh, there's, uh, here's our bell ringer. Where is he? Ah, uh, across again. I think I hate to be the guy being thrown at the damn bell. Oh, I hope we get to throw him at the bell. Oh, we certainly want to ring his one. <laughs> and ring his neck. Wait, wait. I wonder... Maybe it's possible. Okay, now that he... Oh, yeah. Okay, he just watched. <laughs> Get back here, you sneaky motherfucker. Wait. He just <laughs> he just outright disappeared there. I think he shadow face or something. Hmm. I just realized, the town must be very confused. It's 5 o'clock, no, it's 7 o'clock, 15 o'clock, 20? 70? <laughs> oh, I, I should probably, I, let me just kill this guy and for health. Just stay down. Kane getting his suck. Or was no the the joke with uh, Van Helsing was getting sip, getting some sip. <laughs> so yeah, the joke ruined. Yeah, for get the suck is something else. <laughs> yeah. I'm expecting it too late to when you're old enough. Yes. <laughs> okay, he automatically breaks the lock as well. Uh, that was your mistake, idiot. Okay, yeah, he goes he goes incorporeal for a bit to escape from us. I can still hear your footsteps. Get out of the lock. Get out of auto phase because he. Okay, he almost killed us there. <laughs> hmm. What the heck just happened? Yeah, he attacked. He stayed invisible. So, okay. And now we need a snack. Uh, here we have a volunteer. <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah, uh, th this boss fight is going to take a bit. Yeah, it makes me learn something each time. Well, uh, yeah, that, that's something that's a lot of... Yeah, that's often forgotten when it comes to invisibility. Like, you can still make noise, which can still be heard. Like this, yeah. asshole. Yeah, and he's no, he's he's only turn invisible, not turning into thin air. Yeah. If he turns into a mist form, that would be another thing. Well, then then we just have to find a vacuum cleaner and suck him up. But that's not with mist. Uh, mist is basically just water. Yeah. 
Because if you're sending with Steam, then someone tries to suck up mist. Blow up mist, yes, but something up. Uh, huh. m mist is basically just a lot of moisture in the air, so it technically you could suck it up, but yeah, typically there's just so much fog that it doesn't work. But if it oh, was yeah. just a little bit of fog, like say a vampire's worth, then I think it could be possible. <laughs> All right. This is very very possible for if it turns into a dust cloud. Oh, <laughs> then they certainly could be sucked up into a vacuum, <laughs> because that's what vacuum cleaners are all about. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's see. Can we get a weapon again? Or, no, the weapons seem to despawn with each of them, so that is a bit of a, an asshole move from the game. Yeah, I don't get yeah, the why we want to I couldn't think it's being down far from being over the damn axe over here. Okay, you die for blood. Blood for the blood god. Yeah, uh, I don't. Kane wouldn't want to share tributes. <laughs> He'd only Quite sacrifice okay. blood to himself. So Korn can suck it. Or get sucked. Oh, come on! <laughs> Hello there. Now, if I say ring a ding ling, what do you say? Destroy Screw you! you. <laughs> okay, I was uh, I was going to say Bing Bong, but I missed. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of awkward that you missed at that short of range. Yeah, I, I pressed the wrong button combination. I pressed uh, Alt again, to, which would probably which would probably just set him down. And well, since we we're standing on the edge, that just plain dropped his ass down. <laughs> Can I grab you? That, that would be so... Uh, <laughs> okay, come on. Okay, he's, he just dodges out of that, it seems. Because it would yeah. be so satisfying to just fuck him, fucking throw him into the bell. Yeah. As, as I said earlier, I hope we can do that. The damn pixelation? Yeah, he, j he just seems to go inc incorporeal when I try to grab him. Ah, there you are. Yep. And there's his foot. <laughs> uh, yeah, like I said earlier, invisibility doesn't mean that you can't be hurt, so you can typically find some thing or someone that is invisible by sound or like footsteps uh, or the footsteps in happen. earth or water and it seems that these priests aren't spawning oh hello there yeah I guess there was any all the benefits for you to access painting throwing him around yeah, yeah. But why is that one down here? And why is he by the altar of all things? Or did <laughs> did uh, did Marcus rise up to the fact that we're using his puppets against him? Yeah, it makes sense a priest be by the altar, but mm. that's something we've been not coming soon. We yeah, are at the like last quarter of his health, though, so maybe we can just catch him <laughs> like there. <laughs> he would. <was laughs> oh, 
Oh, hello. I hear you are a part of the Bell Ringers Association. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, and there you are. Behind. Okay, yeah, this one is going down for drinks. <laughs> and another. <laughs> Another screenshot that could easily be turned around to make it look like Kane is vomiting into a corner. Because he, he must be getting sick of this peasant blood. Uh oh. And that does make me worried for future scenes. Ah. Rule number two of invisibility you're not a ghost. You can still be found by touch. Okay. Just plant yourself down there of your own accord. Thank you for destroying that fiend. He, he, he robbed me of my mind. He was a novice. Bishop, I require your help. Borador has sent me to gain passage to the Sarafan Keep. One of our associates is held captive there. A fool's errand to enter the very maw of the beast. But yes, I will help you. I will take you there. I will show you the entrance. Okay, that was weird. Kane looked fine, but the face of a bishop was censored. Well done, Kane. You have entered the Seraphan Keep at last. Not without difficulty. I encountered another old friend on the way. Marcus. I see. Then may I assume that another of the Seraphan Lord's guardians have fallen? You may. Many times I attempted to persuade Marcus to join with us, but he would not heed me. My arguments were more convincing. I sense that Uma is being held in the uppermost reaches of the keep. You must hurry. She is to be executed soon. <laughs> Where is the Seraphan Lord? Is he here? I do not know. His presence is masked from my senses. But you are no match for him yet, Kay. If you encounter him, hide. If he sees you, run. Run? Hide? Vorador, you do not know me. Your task is to find Uma quickly. Let nothing distract you. The information she obtained from the industrial quarter may allow us to defeat the Seraphan Lord at last. Do not destroy our only chance with hasty action. How sickened I had become with weary admonitions of safety and care. How I longed to rend the flesh of my one true enemy. How I thirsted for the taste of his life's blood on my lips. Go, Cain, quickly. I will be watching. You had to ruin that last line, did you, Vorador? Because that was the eloquent and spiteful Cain that we all know and love to hate from the other games. 
But yeah. really, Kane, I think you need glasses. Do you live, old man? Like, I'm standing right in front of you. Do I look <laughs> dead? <laughs> oh, you forgot to say even. Yeah. There we go. And I get the feeling we might be meeting the Seraphan Lord here. And yeah, probably and in an escape uh, sequence as we run out. Yeah, and by the way, you don't mind me to remind you of your save and stuff, do you? No. Uh, it's right. I forget easily enough. Alright, and I will do it just to, yeah, you know, be a friend. Even though you torment me, I'm not sure. Don't worry, I won't, I won't hug you like Kane hugs people. But that was a twist. Wait, did I just outpun you? Eh, uh, no. Oh, hello. Dark gift menu, select charm. Okay. Oh, I think I read something about this. Oh no! Target victims and dark gift again to activate. Ah, there we go. I needed to aim down. Oh, hello! <laughs> huh, he actually looked like you. Except uh, he's a bit more bald. Good day, sir. I'll just go fuck myself over here. Is it a bot? Help me, or... help me. <laughs> Come on, we can Somebody cower in fear. Me, I, okay. I can, is it supposed to be a butler or an officer? Yeah, probably just a sir, uh, servant. Somebody help me, please. Okay, now how do we actually let go of him? Like, I think you're supposed to ah, use him. Right, my right click. Good. Uh, ah, you used him to open the door. Okay, that that could be fun. Yeah, I think I think you're gonna need to use that spell later on a very special mission that I have read about. And um, yeah, I'm not gonna spoil it. But I think you're gonna love it. Okay, we can't mind control these guys, which is well, partly to be expected, partly still a disappointment. Wait, wait. that's another checkpoint. Yeah. You know the drill. I think that one was close enough to the last one to keep uh, going a bit more. Point taken. Point taken. Uh, For now, though, hugs. Uh, Blood egg accident, I'm like that bastard. <laughs> Was not my goal. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Just more downstairs. Right low downstairs. And hello there. Trying to grab too early with that. <laughs> yeah, we could have seen that one coming as well. Yeah, and uh, people, a heads up. Try to never, ever run through your sword to someone in armor. Yeah, you're just For going that? to ruin the point. If uh, not, outright break it. Uh, that too, but that was, but here's the, other, the other worst thing that can happen. If you do pierce it, there's a chance you may get stuck. You may what? You may get stuck. Oh yeah. So yeah, so if you do succeed somehow to pierce it, yeah, you don't want to get stuck in the middle of the combat when there's more than one opponent. Then, yeah. Then they have all the time in the world to hit you. Did. So, yeah. If you hit someone with a sword like that and it gets stuck, go for your backup weapon if you have one. 
Is that supposed to be meat or coals? On shore is very pixelated to me here. It's been very pixelated today, except for some cutscenes. Yeah, it might be because my brother is probably downloading uh, the Guild Wars 2 expansions. Uh, might be, or... Um, okay, maybe not the phone. Nope, I, I wonder if there's a way to have this update live without me having to close and act, open it again and again. Hmm. For now though, what are we supposed to do here? We have this thing, but we have no circuits to complete with it. Yep. Oh, I think I know what that is. Can't use this again. I know what that is, Helian. What, the red stuff or this obelisk thing? Uh, the machine thing uh, next to you with the red stuff. Yeah. It's the toaster. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh, hello. It's gonna remind me of the mini grind. <laughs> Never mind. It's not a meat grinder. Oh, oh wait. Is that a corpse uh, disposer? It could be. Uh, or an incinerator would be more. Okay, those there. things. <laughs> those things are outright explosive, apparently. Oh yeah, I'm. I'm guessing this was supposed to be like some sort of weird red coal. That or rust or just yeah, I, I suspect that like you grind up the corpse and burn it. Hmm. So a kind of a meat grinder and incinerator into one. Okay, sit still, you little tailed bastard. Okay, he uh, runs. Can... We can't. We. The rat ran through the reticle there. It didn't change. Yeah. Uh, it kind of makes sense for them to have a meat grinder slash incinerator for... Sure, you can burn bo uh, burn a body. But it takes a bit long time to burn the bones. Yeah, and... Uh, oh, it's, it's one of the rogues. That's why you were attacking the personnel. Oh dear. But yeah, have a meat grinder, hot in the incinerator, definitely should make burning bones uh, a bit quicker work. Yeah. Uh, bur bones burn badly, to my knowledge, because they, well, they're solid and they have um, spaces within them. No, the marrow within would boil, or need to get to a boil. But the bone around it acts as an insulator. I might just be talking out of my ass completely here. Yeah. I know, I know you can burn bone, it just takes too much longer to do it. And you need a very hot fire for it. <laughs> and yeah, t in general, if you split something up, it typically gets easier to deal with. Yeah, and I imagine that these folks don't have. An incinerator as strong as the incinerators we have today that cremate bodies. A few hours even. But still, seeing one there says a lot about the Seraphan. Yeah. Okay, smart guy, just move a bit more to the side. Like that, yes, thank you. Yeah, I, I doubt I could have gotten a sneak attack on him once he was too far away from the fog. But, yeah, <laughs> that still got us an easy hit. Tastes like an alcoholic. Smoker. Oh god, it reminds me of a, a thing from anime 
I have only four episodes of, but I never found it online. Which is? That, oh, I forgot his name, but there's a vampire in, it in one of the episodes. And he complains that it's so hard to find blood that they can suck for. Neither people to smoke or alcoholic. So that the vampires do not want to drink. They want to have someone that is healthy by blood. And of course, the hands of Dave is the one that has clean blood. It's, it's an old anime, but it's kind of funny. It's basically the Japanese, most, I think it's Japanese version of uh, Supernatural almost. It's Supernatural before Supernatural even. Okay. So I guess, yeah, yeah, uh, there are many of those in anime. And uh, actually, if I think about it, one of the detective guys that has a side character, and I think love interest in the main character, who is a woman, he looks suspiciously like Detective Gum from Phoenix Wright. A uh, gumshoe. Yeah, um... almost, a, almost like a clone. The only exception is the other guy is, is obviously smarter. Okay. I get the feeling I might have seen a review of, or not really a review, but more like a video on this show before. And, uh, yeah, I think I'll have to cut this stream short because it's my turn downstairs now for something. Oh? Yeah, basically, um, you know how with the, the lockdown stuff and such, the barbers are, can't... Uh, aren't allowed to have many people uh, anymore well we have a family friend who is a barber and yeah she comes over to do uh, well the barbering over here <laughs> she, she's actually been doing that for years upon f years so yeah that ha <laughs> that's uh, something that hasn't really changed but yeah it seems like I'm uh, my turn now and probably the last one has that Oh, that's been that quite early end of the stream. But you've only been about it about an hour. Uh, yeah, but if I if I were to step away, it would probably be like 10, 15 minutes of people waiting for this. And yeah, I, I know I'm not good or fun enough for people to wait that long. So, yeah, I'll see about making it up tomorrow with this extra stream, perhaps. Just a, a short... <laughs> Uh, yeah, a, a short something Friday, perhaps. We we could, yeah, tomorrow uh, we'll do a bit more aground, since we said we'd look more into that. Sure, I don't mind. Uh, awesome. Yeah, so let's save. And back to the main menu. Now, let's see yeah, yeah. If, if there are actually people watching here. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, when I look at my second screen here, it says statistics one viewer, and from what I've seen, that <laughs> that is my myself being in chat uh, from previous streams that I've <coughs> done, and I think that's because OBS, uh, well, he, it checks activity with people that if they are inactive, it will count them as bots and does not show them as active viewers. So, but according to my phone over here, there are people in chat, bot or not, could just be inactive, could just not be wanting to talk, doesn't really matter to me. Uh, yeah, Beanie typically goes through this list uh, one by one to thank people with some little quip, but I doubt I'll be able to do that for everyone here, but let's still give it a shot. So... <laughs> So thank you for watching Twitch grow with witches, witch us. That 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 totally sounds like a bot name. If you are not, uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, grow witches among us or on Twitch. <laughs> uh, thank you for watching joint efforts. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Beanie, Beanie's quip usually goes like uh, I've forgotten his quip. Yeah, but yeah. Keep uh, working on whatever you are together with whoever you're working and joined with. 
have this too. Uh, have whatever this is. Uh, I have a pen here. You you can't have this though, and you c certainly can't have two. <laughs> Fee Topier, I remember you from Beanie as well. I still have no idea what is that is actually supposed to mean. But uh, whatever you are on top of, stay on top of it. Uh, for noons, uh, keep playing golf at noon. And Droop Dog, uh, yeah, <laughs> stay droopy and stay a dog. <laughs> and <laughs> thank you especially, Drakir. Oh, you're most welcome. And uh, yeah, tomorrow a bit of extra ground to make up for cutting it short here. Sorry, but until then, until then. Be safe, folks. <laughs>